Hi folks, Joseph Kursky here. I used to work at the U.S. Geological Survey and at that agency I, with a couple of colleagues, developed a fun and informative educational tracing activity. So let me show you what this is. Basically what you do is you get some salad trays. These are transparent salad trays that you can get at the grocery store or at a craft store. You can also get some tracing um, uh, transparencies like the old overhead projectors and then you basically get a USGS topographic map like this and then you choose a contour uh, a contour line like a thousand feet above sea level 2,000 feet whatever you want to do and then you have to make tick marks on here so that you can register each one of these trays now each one of these trays is a different ISO line it's a different contour line so you decide which tr contours you're going to trace you trace one per salad tray, and then when you're done, when you register all these together, as you can see here, you've got a three-dimensional mountain or valley. You could even tip it upside down and illustrate to the students how these isolines actually represent three-dimensional landforms. Lava fields, eskers, moraines, canyons, mountains, hills, cliffs, etc. on the landscape. So it's easy to do and it really brings out the whole three-dimensional idea of these isolines. That these, these isolines, these contour lines on these topographic maps actually represent three-dimensional features on the landscape. This is a great way of doing that with students. It's nice and tactile, simple to do, cheap, and I think it illustrates key concepts in map reading, in geomorphology, in mapping. Thanks.